So, I have had the sleep styler in my hair now since last night. Um, I put it in about 11, 11 15, and I tried to go to bed, but let's just say that it was a challenge. And I wouldn't say necessarily it was because of the sleep styler, a lot of it had to do with user error. I'm actually putting it in and stuff like that I may have done it wrong but a lot of it also had to do with the fact that I sleep with my CPAP machine every now and then um, I don't do it every night but last night 
I was already dealing with asthma and really needed some sleep so I put it on last night and let's just say that it tangled and got in everything and yeah so I had to pull it out from the back this morning I should have filmed that part so that you guys could see I apologize if the quality is not that great um, I'm actually using my camcorder right now so hopefully it is still it's like clear enough for you no the light should be right here that would be better okay but I'm gonna go ahead and take it out as you can see some parts absolutely survived other parts like dropped this one's this one here is like barely hanging on um, I was able to sleep last night which was good it's super soft to be able to do it but I think I kind of struggled with it because I had my mask on. When I put it on to make it straight, it was stacked up and down like this on one single strand. Um, and it laid a lot more flat because it didn't have to be like twisted up or curled. And this is the first time I actually curled with it. So, yeah. But I'm going to go ahead and take it out. Like I said, I do have one like hanging right here. It's not the greatest, but we shall see. So, I did like that I was able to sleep with it and not worry about my hair being wet. It seemed like it dried it. So, you have a really nice bounce curl to it. So, that's really nice. It's a thick curl in comparison to what um, my hair, my natural hair would normally do. And it's an elongated curl, so that's super nice. And my hair feels soft. Um, and definitely feels smooth. Yeah, that's a cute bounce curl. And my hair is super duper soft it feels good it seems like my right side is the side that fell out more Oops. when I wrapped this one I tangled it I think So there's some nice thick curls in here, which I don't have. Um, I'll go ahead and insert a picture so that you can see. I have tighter coil type curls naturally. And it looks like it really just smoothed out my curls. But the problem I had last night and I felt that when I did my hair straight, I had it then as well, was that I couldn't get as close to the base of each group of strand um, to get as close to the scalp area. So, there we go. boys are getting ready for school so the house is going to start getting loud that one actually is really nice considering it was hanging it's got a nice bounce so on days where I think I want to um dry my hair and don't have time to wait for it to naturally dry like I did last night it's one of the reasons why I use this product this is the one I kind of twisted and wrapped um, I think this would work this is the one that's kind of just hanging here so I don't know that this curl will come out did on the edges at least but you know if I don't want to dry my hair 
or sit around and wait for it to dry this is a really good option because my hair was you know as you start to roll it it started to dry in comparison to what it was because it was pretty wet um but it didn't like leave my pillow wet or anything like that it seemed like the actual microfiber portion of it actually soaked up the wetness without having to worry about all of that so that's good and I don't feel any pain so sleep wise um I was able to get some sleep these are super soft to sleep with which I think is a plus but they were uncomfortable now I honestly contribute that to having my um, CPAP mask on because I didn't wear it the night that I put it on to make straight hair and I was able to sleep without any problem but I did sleep it's just the problem was when I got up to use the bathroom I usually take my sleep pack machine off and I couldn't do it it was stuck so it you should have seen it. it was like I had to release it from the holes it was like hanging on this side it was a mess so all of the rollers are out and I'm going to normally if I do like large barrel curls I'll kind to zhuzh my hair just a bit to keep it from so just like when it was sleeping I mean when it was straight my hair is very very soft um, it's got some really nice volume and even if it didn't grab the top part of my curls I think the weight of it helped to kind of pull it out some because it seems like it's fairly smooth up here So there we go nice like I, I normally can't wear my hair with like gigantic voluminous curls like this because my natural hair is not this way but you know just from the sleep styler I have nice large bouncy curls I hope that camera's picking this up I'm gonna be pissed um it's nice large bouncy curls so I think that that came out really good so there you go and I'm gonna go ahead and take a picture so you guys can see what it looks like but I think with a little bit of serum to help but my hair doesn't feel frizzy it is super soft it smells just like my shampoo and conditioner or actually less than I used my your Viva Lads but it's got really really pretty bounce nice large voluminous curls as you can see so I like it um for straightening my hair I didn't think that it gave me what I needed um because I just couldn't get that far up to my head so I would still have to straighten this area up here but it left my hair really really soft which I enjoyed and it gives me the opportunity to actually you know not have to sit around and wait for my hair to dry um, when it's wet so I really like that 
last night as well it did take me a little while so it'll be a learning curve for me but I really like the curls and it seems like I've juiced it up and fluffed it somewhat and the curls are still kind of hanging in there I don't see much of my natural curl it's all of the you know large bouncy curls which is great of course if my hair gets wet I'm sure my natural curl will kick in and it'll be much tighter but overall I mean even if it didn't get the top part it still looks nice and full and I really do like it so I'm gonna take some pictures and toss them in here so you guys can see I know this is a long video um, I'm gonna try speed it up where I can but I figured that I would show it to you and I'm sorry I'm coming to you guys looking like a hot mess but that is my video if I had to rate the sleep styler I would definitely give you or give it an 8 to 9 um, not necessarily a 10 on my sparkle scale because it seems like there's a learning curve and there is definitely practice I would need especially since my hair is past my butt um, but it dried my hair it left my hair shiny I don't seem to have any frizz on um, my hair I apologize because my video cut out but I wanted to add that it really left my hair feeling nice and soft and smelling really nice as well as bounce and shine I do suggest this it is a little costly comes in two sizes a large which is for long thick or curly hair and the mini which is for shorter hair or hair that is long but is fine they retail for $30 each and you can get them at thesleepstyler.com for a full review on these products you can also head on over to honeygirlsworld.com which is my blog where I'll have pictures and more details thanks for watching